I'm down here in Slocum. It's getting later in the evening. Uh, we can tell it's getting a little later in the year. It's mid-August and the uh, days are not quite as long. I've been at it all day today. Been fighting the rain. It's been raining some. The bees have been crazy. I was down here in Slocum earlier putting Apivar strips. I decided to put it in all the hives. If you'll remember, I built up the 16 hives out here and now we're down to 13. We lost three of them. Uh, so I'm just gonna flip this camera around here and, and show you what I'm doing. Uh, if you like what you see, if you subscribe, hit the thumbs up, and also hit the notification bell for future videos from me. Yeah, it's got to be right there. <clears throat> oh, it got me. Nope. Tried to get me in the head, but it got me on the wrist. They're still a little feisty, apparently. <laughs> All right, let's get to it. As you can see here, I went over to Rusty's place, and I bought 12 hives from him. 10 nukes and two full-strength hives. And so I'm gonna replace these three hives out here with uh, three of these nukes. One thing Rusty does that works well is he uses this uh, corner bead for drywall or sheetrock. He just cuts it in the right length and staples it to the box. And it works well to transport bees. Yeah, these bees are released and they're mad. Let's go to Lake Patty Sue. And these two over here. This was a complete dead out spot, so I just set a 10 frame box right there. Here's what I did with the nukes that I'm gonna combine with the weak hives. Just set them on top for now so they can get oriented. Well, it's the next day back out here at Lake Patty Sue. You can see these nukes are just busting at the seams. They're bearding and busy. I'm just gonna take uh, the, the nuke and set it down beside the box that's going into, which is the box below it. There really are not many bees in those hives on the pallet. They're just very weak and they need to be uh, strengthened. But I'm gonna take the bees in the bottom box and I'm gonna take them off a ways and shake them off the frames. And in the meantime, I'm gonna take the bees from the nuke and stick them down in that box. And the bees coming back, I should join them without too much trouble. I'm gonna smoke them quite a bit. And I haven't seen queens in, in a lot of these hives. Um, they might be queenless, I don't know. By shaking them out, I'll, I'll probably guarantee that the queen will not end up back in the hive. So that's kind of my plan. I don't really have time to videotape, but I've got to get busy. I still got a fair amount to do this afternoon and, and time is running short. I hope it'll work out okay. I don't see how it won't. I've milked these hives along really all summer and they just, something has to be done. They shouldn't be this week right now. So we got to do something about it. 
We got that done. Obviously strengthen these hives. Look at how much stronger that looks. It was super weak. I uh, just combined these hives. I think the method I used worked well. Another one right there. All the ones with the red tape on them. Right there. We're done out here for a little while. For another week or two, I may come out and do some treatment for mites. And just kind of peek in. Some of these hives I thought might have been queenless. I may order some queens and just a few to replace some of the queens. But beyond that, I think we're getting pretty close to being ready to go. Got a lot done the last couple of days, so now maybe you can slow down just a little bit for me. I'm tired, but I love it. Gonna head down to Slocum now, get a, three more nukes into some other boxes and return the nukes to Rusty. Then I'm gonna head home and rest. Y'all know what to do. Hit the thumbs up, subscribe, hit that bell for future videos from me. I sure appreciate you watching. Once again, remember, it's not a how-to uh, channel. We're just like a vlog, just kind of showing you what I'm doing. So, uh, some things work and some things don't. But I think this is going to work this time really well. Y'all take care. On to the next video.